the way it was. Uh, so we gave him a run. Uh, nobody expected us to be here. We weren't, so we tried and, uh, you know, just didn't come up with a key hit when we needed it. We had a few runners on here and there. Um, good pitcher, you know, she threw a lot of strikes, threw it hard, kept, kept moving the ball around on us, so she did a good job. So, and Alex did an excellent job, hold them to two runs, you know. Right. Our defense plate made some great plays on the infield against their quick runners. You know, we uh, kind of went into that five-person defense to try to, because uh, she was batting over almost 600, so that's why we were trying to shut that down. And we, for the most part, we did, so I think we did a good job of that, you know. We just couldn't come up with a big hit when we needed it, and that's the name of the game. Um, have you worked on that? I, I don't remember seeing you do that Yeah, a lot. we have. Okay. We've worked on it. We've known it. We've had it in. Um, we don't use it very often, but we uh, decided to throw it in tonight because we knew she had a ton of speed. And right. If she, she laid the ball down, we weren't going to get her. So we had to bring everybody up and still have coverage on two. So right. we were going to try to make them lift the ball. That was our um, point behind it, trying to make them lift the ball and we, so we could get it in the air and get a chance to catch it. Awesome. Can you say something about your three seniors? Uh, four? They're doing? awesome. You know, uh, it's my first time having five in a year. I've, now I've been at North Butler five years. They started with me when eighth graders. Um, you know, we went to state that year. We fell short every other year. But, you know, Nicole started since she was in eighth grade catching for me. I think she had started every game until last year. She had a little stint where she had an injury, and then she didn't catch. But other than that, she played every game. You know, Marcy, you can't say enough about her. You know, she's bad in that second spot. Hit between three and 400, over 400 for three or four years. You know, she's a three-time All-Stater, you know. Never played outfield until uh, her freshman year, and we decided to move her out there, and she did an excellent job. Has done an excellent job the whole time, you know. And then uh, Morgan has done an excellent job out and left, you know. She uh, we kind of converted over to Flapper, and she's done a good job of putting the ball in play and making plays, and done a good job, you know. And then you got Abby, you know, she played third for us, played first before it, so they've all done a good job. Okay. Thank, you right. very much. Thank you. And um, what can you say about that seventh inning rally there for your team? What kind you know, of sparked that? That's we just talked about it. Not never give up, you know. And that's what I'm proud of. You know, Nicole gets up there, and I told her, "Give one a ride," and she did, you know. And then Molly gets on, and we actually went into a hit and run, and it was uh, Alexis. It was way high, so she did a good job. And then you know, Molly got Molly on second, got her back on a pass ball. So we were just trying, you know, just trying to scratch a couple runs off and uh, see what we could do. All right, so just kind of talk about the team's overall performance here tonight. Uh, we had to earn that one. North Butler came out playing uh, tough defense, and we knew they had good bats throughout their lineup, so we knew we had to earn it. Meister did a great job on the mound, uh, keeping them off balance. Our defense was pretty solid all the way through, which it had to be, two to one game. Uh, you gotta play, gotta play good ball. Absolutely, and then the kind of breakthrough for the team was that error they had early on. So, right. kind of, did you guys just yeah. kind of keep that momentum throughout the game? Well, you know, they they uh, we had an error and gave them that little break, uh, but we were able to get out of that. Um, and their uh, hitter came through with a big home run, but luckily it was a solo home run, no one on base. So, uh, with the 2-0 lead there, we felt fortunate that you know uh, we were able to get uh, get through that earlier in the game without uh, giving up any runs there. Um, our wheels uh, were able to come through on the bases in the inning that we did score and a lot of close plays, but uh, went our way uh, in that inning, in the one inning that we did score. Absolutely. And then obviously this is um, postseason time, so yeah. every win is huge. Correct. Uh, yeah, uh, you guys will face Clarksville come Monday, so kind of... Right, and it is regional time, and you can tell the atmosphere is great here and both teams playing and giving all they all they could uh, for that game. And it could have gone either way. It was a well-played game for both teams, and uh, it went our way, and the girls did earn it. And, yeah, it's that time of year, so you got to come out ready to play. Clarksville with the win tonight, 2-0 to zero is what I heard over BGM. Yep. We played them earlier in the year. They were able to uh, beat us both times for conference play, but I think our team's ready to battle it out again and see what happens. And then what are going to be the keys in that game? What it's going to be again? Kind of yeah, the pitching has to be you know sharp, and uh, our defense has to be solid, and we have to be able to come through and execute at the plate and try to pick up a few runs off of Weddy King. She's an excellent pitcher, uh, so we just have to be ready and see uh, be ready for our opportunities. And then obviously the winner of that game will go to state, so right. that'll be a much bigger stage than even tonight's game. Oh, so correct. Yeah. Uh, what can you say about your I team know, and how they're going to yeah. rise to the challenge? Uh, well, like I said, I think they'll be ready for it, and they've been looking forward to this and hoping for, for this opportunity um, when we lost a close one earlier in the season against Clarksville. So uh, they'll be ready for their opportunity and hopefully uh, be able to keep the nerves you know, from uh, getting in there too far, too much and stay relaxed and play good ball.